y'all it's kennedy simone here and i am back again with another video if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe to be a part of ken's crew because we're the best crew okay you're already here join the fam subscribe all that good stuff so today as you can tell i will be finally filming the long awaited room tour so basically i've been trying to find different things more wall art that i wanted to find for my room that fit well um, and it's just been a journey, but I finally found pretty much everything except for wall art for my bathroom that will be coming literally next week. But I was like, I'm not putting out this video. My room will probably never be exactly how I want it because it's still a few things that I wish I could add. But I'll just let y'all know what I would add and then y'all kind of have to just envision it. But yeah, definitely if you like these types of videos, um, I will definitely make some cleaning videos, all that kind of stuff. So you'll see my room a lot more. I've just been trying to film this first so y'all can have some mystery, you know, still. So without further ado, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Kennedy Simone. You know, that's always great. And then like this video if you like this kind of content or if you like me so yeah let's just jump right into the video because i know y'all ready y'all ready come on let's go so my theme is blush pink white gray and silver it's like my general theme so yeah i hope you guys enjoy it Alrighty. so most of the time my fan and my light are both off because i love natural sunlight if y'all know me y'all know i love natural sunlight today it's a little gloomy so it is a little dark but i lightened up the camera so it shouldn't make too much of a difference but yeah so this is the beginning of my room i'm gonna start with the bathroom and closet first um just because you know why not so to the right of my door is my bathroom so i can't have both of them open at the same time which i don't necessarily like but at the same time i usually always keep my bathroom door closed um but yeah when i'm in here i'll keep the bathroom door open so it's just vice versa but yeah so let's go into the bathroom So as you walk into the bathroom, this is what you see. A mirror, a big, a nice mirror. Um, these are the light fixtures. Let's see if we can focus. Y'all can see it a little bit. That's the light fixtures. Um, this is the big old mirror. Love it, very big. Um, and then I have, just on top are my like smaller mirrors so if I need to see something up close. My speaker that I always use in the shower. Um, I also have this hand dispenser. I think I got this from Walmart um, and I just fill it up with soap. I just bought a big thing of soap and then just refill it. Um, and then I have my nice sink or whatever, just like a little circle sink. My African black soap, this is the face um, soap that I use. So this is my hand soap, this is my face soap. 
some paper towels right here because um, I found that using paper towels is better for my skin um, just because using a washcloth sometimes it can be a little less sanitized so yeah and then I just have this marble trash can on the side I think I got that from like um, where did I get that from not home goods oh bed bath and beyond and then yeah and then i have just my tissue roller which is really far down i don't like that i wish it was like up here or something um just spray down there just because it's not as cute to put up here and i was gonna get a basket that is the same material as this but i have not found that yet but that's where i'm gonna keep like um my spray maybe some wipes um a candle poopery or whatever you know, just in case guests come over and they want to use that kind of stuff. So yeah, I just got these towels, nothing extra. If I haven't said it already, I am kind of simple when it comes to decor, so I really don't mind like some plain walls and stuff. It's fine with me, it just gives me a clean look. So I like that. I got these towels from um, Walmart or Bed Bath & Beyond, but I think Bed Bath & Beyond. And then I have these curtains, which aren't, shower curtains but for some reason they put them up so high like you see where the sh like the end of the tub liner or whatever ends it's like way at the top so it's like gives us a good chunk probably eight inches and so none of the regular shower curtains fit so i just made holes i put two curtains together so yeah it looks like that but i actually have a shower liner of course um but yeah if you guys want to see how my shower my bath looks nothing major i have to wash my hair soon so that i have all these products right here but i usually don't have them right there they're usually in my hair ottoman that you'll see later um but yeah and i just have some you know bath products but nothing major um and then right here i just have my laundry basket which has two little sections in between like that i need to do laundry i just came back from vacation literally um, yesterday so don't judge me <laughs> I have to do laundry and then um, also I have my towel rack because I don't have like a linen closet so I had to buy a towel rack which I don't mind but yeah and I just keep some wipes right here um, like I said I'll get a little basket and I'll put it in there and as, um, as well as the um, spray but I do also have these gray rugs that I got from either Walmart or Bed Bath and & Beyond and then I got that from like the dollar store like the plunger and all that kind of stuff but it's real just hidden in the back because it's gray so I don't really care where that's from it just needs it to do the job but yeah that's pretty much how it looks um don't mind the curtain being open but yeah this is pretty much how it looks I have some cabinets down here um under here I just have extras, cleaning supplies, um, all that kind of stuff. It's somewhat organized. I don't know if you can tell, but I know exactly where everything is. So it's organized for me. Some stuff has to be sit, sat on top just because it's bigger. But yeah. And then I'm not going to show you guys too in-depth of these drawers because I just came back from vacation, like I said. And yeah, they're not organized at all. So this is my skincare slash hygiene things that I need on a daily basis. Um, so deodorant toothbrush toothpaste um, um, spin brush whatever I need to use on a daily basis moisturizer sunscreen all that and then this is my hair thing that I use every single day all of my hair products that I use every day or hair tools that I use are here and then I have extras down here but yeah they're pretty nice size drawers um, I love that space i just wish there was like a linen closet or something but i made it work over there so yeah this is the bathroom so yeah nothing major nothing major yes as you come from my door this is my bathroom and straight ahead when you come in my door is my closet so yes this is how it looks it's a pretty nice size closet but yeah this is just a little overview of my closet um lots of space for sure 
So let's go in. So right off the bat, you see this blackness, okay? So I have like a lot of extra pillows that I didn't really want to throw away. Um, Cause you know, if guests come, I want them to have like pillows to, I don't know, lay with or something or on the couch or something in our living room. But yeah, so these are my two pillows that I have extra. And I have this ottoman. Um, I usually sit down on it to put my shoes on or stand on it to reach the top shelves up here. But yeah, it usually, it has all my hair products. I have a hair ottoman. Um, I had this from my dorm room from freshman year. So you can watch those two um, vlogs, my freshman year dorm room vlog and my sophomore year if you guys are interested in like other room tours and how dorm life was for me so basically yeah this is what i have right here it's not in the way of closing the door so that works out perfectly i have it like catty corner to where i can still close the door but yeah and then behind that let's see i have just my extra like purses and stuff and backpacks i also have my like winter jackets and things like that and then down here, I have um, some some sandals like on a shoe rack that I got from Walmart. And then I also have some more shoes right here. Don't mind the price tag on that. But yeah, I have some more shoes over here. Extra hangers um, just because. Um, and then underneath, I have all of my pants. So it goes from like color to dark to denim jeans. Then I have like sweatpants and then I have hoodie slash pullover so yeah and then down there of course I said I have my like fall jackets well all my jackets in general and then once we come up here I have all of my clothes color coded so these are all of my tops and they go from light to dark as you can see and then back there I have business attire since I don't use it as often so I put it back there I have my belt slash hat rack where I have all of my belts and stuff and then I have some more business attire, um, church slash dressy, semi-dressy attire. I have my pants right here. Um, and then my dresses and jumpsuits. And then my comfy, comfy robes. I love robes, by the way, y'all. If y'all didn't know, I love robes. And then up here, I just have my black more black pants and then these are some denim shorts less denim skirts these are some fall-ish skirts um shorts back there then i have my pants right here and then some more skirts then i also have some like extras i think i'm gonna switch this to this side and this to that side just because this is like the first thing you see and i don't really like the look of that but yeah i just have a steamer some my laundry stuff extra tissue for my bathroom and stuff but yeah this is how it looks nothing major it's definitely not as organized as it could be i was gonna get some baskets for these like i said i'm not completely finished so i'm going to still do that but just for now it's working for me so yeah this is just how it looks of course i'm gonna like switch um my closet around to be prepared for fall but yeah this is just how it's looking as of right now but yeah it does the job and now for the main attraction this is my room so yeah so first off right here as you enter from my door this is my ottoman i love it i got it from ross for like a hundred bucks it's so cute um when i saw this i was like i'm instantly gonna do my room blush pink like as the accent color because I had to get it. It was so cute and so affordable. So yeah, this is what it is. It actually has lots of storage, which I found that I needed a lot more of just because I have a lot of miscellaneous and just random things that I needed to store in here. Um, this is my bear that I got this summer because I have never been to build a bear in my life. So I got one because my best friend Rayleigh from back home, she works at build a bear. And so she, we all made like our own thing and we have like, it talks to and everything, but I'm not gonna show you guys cause yeah, that's for us. <laughs> and then, um, this is my camera equipment. I also have like my studio equipment um, for when I'm recording songs and stuff. Um, and just kind of a lot of stuff. I have like an extra pillow in here, my old lamp, um, phone case. This is some stuff that I use to hang up 
some of my paintings, like command strips and stuff. I have this like contact paper. I was gonna do my desk marble, but it didn't really look right. So I just put that in there for maybe later. Um, just a lot of random things. I actually was looking for this for my Miami trip, my portable charger, but yeah, most of it is equipment. So camera equipment and studio equipment is mostly in here. And then my backdrops, I have some backdrops and stuff. I'm gonna get back to it. I just needed to film this video first, honestly. Um, but yeah, so this is a lot of storage. If you can tell, this is very deep. So I use all of this space. So yes, and I probably will put some blankets in here too. Um, just because for when gets, guests come over and they're a little chilly because sometimes it gets a little cold in here. So yes, this is how it looks. I love this ottoman. I highly recommend um, getting an ottoman for your room because it's like multi-purpose. You can sit on it, you can store things in it and it looks cute. So yeah, over here is not the cutest, but it's functional for me. I just keep my, I usually don't put my purse on the ground because you know, I don't know, but um I just put it down there for the video so it wouldn't show. But I usually keep it on this ottoman. And then I have this little bitty baby marble trash can. I think I got it from like Family Dollar or something like that. Super cheap, super affordable. But it does the job because I don't need a huge trash can for my actual room. Um, more so just for my bathroom and kitchen. So yeah. And then this is my gym bag. This is my school bag. Um, it's already packed for today. And then this is my... Um, binder for my class that I don't have today so I usually just keep whatever I'm not using out like on the side so yeah this is just how that looks and then come over here this is my desk so I just have my calendar over here I have this lamp it has a USB on the back right here and it's super cute and like industrial looking so I love the look of that um, and it like moves and stuff like you can put it however position you want um, but yeah, I love that. And then I have my mirror that if I sit down and do my makeup at this desk, then that'll be the mirror that I use, which I do use most of the time. And then this is my laptop. It's usually sitting right here on my bed. I have usually some water and then some pl a plant I got from freshman year. I can't remember what it's from, probably like a Ross or Marshalls or something. But yeah, definitely check out my freshman and sophomore year dorm tours because uh, most of my stuff I kind of reused. And then it came with this desk and chair, of course. But yeah, this is just what it looks like. Um, sorry about all the fuzz, the white fuzz. Um, this blanket caused this blanket to have so much white fuzz on it, but that's neither here nor there. But yeah, underneath my desk, I have a lot under here, actually. Um, I have my big makeup container with most of my makeup. This is like, if I do my makeup kind of on a daily basis, this is what I use. Um, I have some extra brushes down there, sunglasses in the green container, extra makeup bag back there, um, some jewelry. This is also a jewelry container, extra storage that I still haven't like set up yet. I think I don't really want to put it on my desk because it'll be too much clutter. So I'm gonna just probably keep it like that. And then, or put the extras in my ottoman where I keep everything else. <laughs> I have a lot of packages that I need to film videos with. Um, so a lot of content is coming soon because I do need to film a lot of videos. Um, my printer, which I haven't set up yet. You can see all the other stuff. My laptop case, cause when I bring my laptop to school, I um, put it in a case. I have some extra games back here. I have. Mancala, if y'all know how to play Mancala, you're a real one. Um, I also have this game, what is it, Taboo, yeah. And yeah, this is like an organizer thing, but I don't have anywhere to put it, so I just kept it under here. Um, but thank you, Mom, for <laughs> getting it. This is um, my little outlet. Oh my gosh, I just realized my clock fell. I knew something was missing. Okay, this was not right there. This is literally up here like this okay i knew something was off but hey it's fine i mean yeah we know it was supposed to be up here but yeah dang that's crazy i didn't realize that i saw the scratch but i didn't know okay well on to the next so over here in this corner i just keep some spray um i also keep a lighter for my candles and stuff i need to um get a fall like some fall candles i put my 
I put my normal candle out in the living room because it doesn't really smell that well. I don't know, like it doesn't have really a scent at all, honestly. And then this is my camera charger. I have two now because I lost one and then I found it, but I had already ordered a second one. So yeah, and I have my to-do list and stuff. So all of that in my office hours and stuff. So yeah, that's over there. I also forgot to mention, I used to keep my slide somewhere over here, maybe over here or under the desk, wherever or even on this side sometimes. So yeah, but whatever, wherever it comes off, honestly. And then over here, I just have my diffuser. It like changes colors, I love that. Um, I have this gold K, which um, gold isn't really my theme, but it works because it's just right there. And then I have this cup that I usually have filled to the brim with mints, but I'm running low as you can see. And the, um, the remote for my um, my light and I'll show you guys how it works right now so this is the fade effect that I usually have it on where it like alternates colors um, and just changes and stuff I hate that you can see the ripples but yeah that's pretty much how it looks um, but yeah and then I have just cords over here and then back here I haven't really taped the light yet like it's still hanging because I wanted to use half of it for there and half of it for behind my headboard but I need a whole set of like the actual outlet part and another remote for, or not another remote but like just another outlet for it and I haven't gotten that yet so yeah for now I'm just gonna keep it like this until I know for sure that I have enough like extra to put behind my headboard but yeah so that's just all that kind of stuff um, I'm gonna show you guys the bed, but yeah, most of my stuff is from Ross, CJ Max, Marshalls, Bed Bath and Beyond, and then yeah, that's pretty much where everything is from. So yeah, over here, I got this painting that took me the longest to find. This is like what the holdup was, but yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, it has like a silver glitter Eiffel Tower, if you can see. Yeah, you can't tell too much, but it's literally sparkly like I don't know but yeah and then it has the blush tone that my room is and it gives me a fall vibe I love it my favorite season is fall so it gives a fall vibe without like the orange and stuff so yeah that is what my bed looks like um yeah love it love it love it comforter from Walmart um that's the only thing pretty much um, and obviously these shams and then my decorative pillows are probably from Ross TJ Maxx Marshalls Something like that. So yeah, and then this is like my actual bed spread like underneath um, It goes with the theme still and then this headboard is from Target Super affordable is like 120 something or 140 something something like that But yeah, that's where that's from and I forgot to show you guys over here this is my mirror, uh, like circle mirror. These two plants are from like freshman year. <laughs> and then the actual mirror is from Target. Oh, and the, the mirror is from Ikea. Um, what else is big? I think I showed you guys like where the big items are from. Some of the other things I don't know for sure because it's been a minute, but yeah, this is just how it looks. I love the look of the like dark wood. It goes really well with like my room and stuff and so yeah so also underneath i have some under the bed storage where i keep a lot of my clothes so i usually have to like flip it up like this and mess my bed up so this first drawer has my undergarments like bras undies socks undergarments all that kind of stuff and this drawer has like my bathing suits all that kind of stuff over there and then my um sleepwear on the right these are my shirts Mind you, none of this is like super duper organized. And then some shorts and workout gear down there. So yeah, this is what my under the bed storage looks like. I also have a lot of things way back in the back of my um, bed. And I'll show you guys also, I keep a lot of like extra school supplies over here, or some books over here. Yeah, just a lot of extras back there. You can't tell, but literally everything under my bed is filled. But I know where everything is, and it's pretty much organized, but you can't tell too much. Also, this is like some more um, makeup eyeshadow palettes, but it just didn't fit over there. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much everything for my room. 
so yes that is pretty much everything i hope you guys enjoyed my room tour if you guys want to see different videos in my room like clean with me's or i don't know decorate with me for fall or christmas or whatever the case is definitely leave them in the comments below with other video suggestions as well because i'm getting back to it your girl is well rested i came back from my birthday vacation so definitely check it out i went to miami so yes for my 21st birthday on October 1st but yes I'm so excited to kick back my YouTube channel um, I've been taking a little break so stay tuned because your girl is coming with the heat okay I will just talk to you guys later again definitely subscribe if you haven't already give this video a thumbs up it really helps me out a lot and gets other people to see my videos and stuff so I would really appreciate it if you give this video a thumbs up and also follow me on the gram at Kid Anissa Simone for all the slayers okay because i be slaying as it don't look like it but i be slaying sometimes okay and then that's pretty much it i'm done done promoting myself <laughs> but yeah so i will check you guys out in my next video see you guys next time passion purpose prosper bye Kennedy, Simone.